This week on Kitty Met Chris, we hit the grill and the beach. Hey, Kate, what's that? That blue water looks just like a postcard. Dang, did the wheels fall off this place while I did. <laughs> Uh-oh. Katie's dancing in her chair. She's so excited to get started. So grab your chopsticks and let's get to it. Where do we go from? Where do we go from here? Welcome back to Hotel Nick's in Cancun's gorgeous and picturesque hotel zone. And tonight we get tapenaki grill <laughs> and water. <laughs> okay, you got this. Oh, it's like Benihana, but with a much better view. Mm -hmm. That's true. This view is amazing. to make mine on a separate grill because you know I'm the weakling. I got mine already because it's on the other grill and it is absolutely fantastic. Probably looking up my nose. It's really good. I got the salmon. Oh, it melts in your mouth. It has butter, it has garlic, it has soy um, uh, sauce. It's really good. Look the perfection. But these vegetables. I think this place is definitely as good as any other. Oh, wow. I'm not missing the step. This place is fantastic. If you get a chance, come to Nick's. It is awesome. I know they're not paying us to say that. We're actually paying a lot of money to stay here. What's that? We just hit 1,500 subscribers. That's kind of crazy that 1,500 people clicked the little subscribe button. Thank you for all of our subscribers. That really means a lot. It helps our channel to grow. Uh, it helps us to offset the cost of production. Wow, it's just, it's <laughs> kind of crazy. Please keep sharing, liking, get your friends to subscribe. And uh, our goal is to hit 10,000 subscribers. So we'll see if we can get it. Let's try. We hit a thousand in Bali, 1500 in Cancun. Let's see where we'll be at 5,000. There's also a great Italian restaurant at Nick's called Chianti. We had a wonderful meal there, but forgot to video. So thankfully we took this picture for Instagram. So we're having a great time here. But, beautiful place. Yeah, beautiful place. On the downside, uh, the power's been out since yesterday. Yep, only hotel in the hotel zone with no power. So we'll see how this works out. <laughs> Although we're pretty good without power, so we'll see what goes on. Yeah. <laughs> we're gonna go see if they have food now. So. Maybe cold cuts. Hey. It's always, I think. Fruit, fruit, that's it. 
They can always have fruit. This <laughs> brain locks up. I love that. All right, out we go. So the power was only out for a day, but dang, did the wheels fall off this place while it did. <laughs> Thankfully, it's back on now, and I think everything's back to normal. So we're heading to dinner. We're going sushi. Sushi. Let's hope they have sushi. I'm sure they do. It probably didn't defrost while the wheels were falling off the bus. <laughs> we'll find out. Gotcha. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Got you table dancing. <laughs> After another incredible sushi feast, we wander around the hotel grounds, then head to our balcony to watch night fall over the city. This, as they say, is the life. This is the last day of what has been an absolutely fantastic beach week here for us in Cancun. And the water has gotten calmer and calmer throughout the week. That blue water looks just like a postcard. The only place I've ever seen it is in Bacalar. We crossed the borderline into our dream. Nothing will ever be. As real as this is. We savor one last lunch with this gorgeous view and leave you with the time lapse because we wouldn't really be travel vloggers if we didn't. So take me away some other place. Don't want away. Oh my Indian summer. Take me away. I am afraid. Calling your name. Oh my Indian summer. We're on the way to the airport, but we're not taking a plane. We gotta go meet Otto. But that, as they say, is a story for another time. More specifically, that's a story for next week. So thank you for watching, and we'll see you then. Keep the thumbs up and subscribe. Oh, no, that was good. That was good. That was good. <laughs>